for a visit this morning and probably let us have seen somebody else come by and uh, Your ladies all over! Your ladies all over! Here's your sign. Philharmonic House Painting and Wrecking Company is here to help you out. Yeah, I'm the president, president of the Philharmonic House Painting and Wrecking Company. We got a motto. Yeah, boy, what's the motto? You want to hear our motto? What's the motto? Our motto, if your house gives you trouble, don't worry or fuss. You'll clean it or wreck it. It don't matter to us. Oh, that's fine. How do you what's like that motto? Why is that? Oh, that gives us class. Oh, yeah. Well, well, now, what you want to be? Cleaned or wrecked? <laughs> you tell me, you want to get cleaned or wrecked? Oh, cleaned. Oh, cleaned. 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 Cleaned, yes. Yeah, all right. Very well. Ordinarily, you only clean houses, but you look pretty uh, no, dusty no, here, no, you know. You don't understand, Mr. The yeah, house yeah. that I want cleaned, the treasure house. You want the house? house. The house clean? The treasure house, yes. Yes, yes that's right. right. You clean the very nice I would like you to, if you would, would you wash the windows and, and dust the books and beat the rugs? Well, let's see now. We beat the windows, dust the rugs, and wash the books. No, 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 no. You don't wash, okay, the, wash the books and, and, and beat the windows. Oh, no, no, you're just joking. You know a lot about cleaning them. I can give you a nice job with my company. No, I don't want a job with your company. You can start at the bottom and work your way up to the top of the stub tail. No, no. You I don't work your way up the mop. That's not what I had in mind. Work your way up no, the I don't want your company to clean my house, if you, you want. Oh, you brought your company to clean the house. Yes. Around the president of the company. Oh, well, all right, then. If you'd get to work I got my two cousins here to help. Oh, you have help? Yes, and I have my two cousins to help me. Oh, oh, well, uh, I don't do any work. I don't. You only pay for three men. Well, I don't need three men to clean the. You only pay for three men. Two of them do all the work. I really do. But I don't really. Oh, how do you do? This is I think this is Donner. Which one is Donner? Which is they? This is Donner. Will you? You Donner? He's Blitzen. Donner Blitzen. Hold up your right hand if you're Donner. No. They're both Donner and Blitzen. I tell you about this compromise. We call them Irving and George. Yeah, well, that's take fine. I, I, but now we're going to give you a demonstration how to clean the house. I don't need three now, men. Three to clean it won't cost you anything. You don't have to pay for only three men. Now, I don't do any work. Oh, I've got two. I I'm the president. Yeah. All right. I'm in charge. Yes. You know what that means when you're president? No. You're in charge. You don't do nothing. I see. All right, we're going to give a free demonstration. Get the dirt. Bring the dirt in. Bring what the are they dirt. doing? What are they doing? I don't understand. We're going to have a free demonstration. No. Oh, 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 Irving and George. Oh, no, 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 Irving and George. Wait a minute. I don't want you to. It's Irving and George. You're putting the dirt all over the place. You ever see a better demonstration than that in your life? Isn't that wonderful? It's great, but it's now what am I going to do with all this dirt and dishes? Now I have to hire you. We're going to clean it up. Oh, all right. Thank goodness. Oh, look at that. Yeah, you need that. I think you'll need that to clean up here you right now. Yeah. So it's got a bum crew cut here. No, no, that's not. You ought to have a little bit taken off the sideburns there, Charlie. No, no. You see, brother, he's got a nice personality, but he's pretty skinny, you know. No, 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 that's not my brother. Let's him up a little bit. No, it's not my brother. That's a broom. That's a broom. That's a broom. Yes. Well, for goodness sake, it is a broom. <laughs> you imagine that? Yeah. Now well, I tell you how it's going to be. We have a very new way. Okay. Now we pile all the dirt in the middle of the floor. Yes. We get the hose, turn on the water, wash the dirt out the back door. Get the no, hose. No, no, wait a minute. No, wait. George, George, wash the water. Water. water here. Turn the hose. No, no, no. Oh, oh, you don't want no to water in there. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want it that turn way. Turn on the water. I don't want the water there. Turn on the water. House? You can't have the water. No. That's what you said? That's what you said. You don't want it that way. No, you I don't. Know what you better do? What? You better take your finger and put it in the end of the hose because <gasps> Irving just turned on the water. <laughs> well, now, I tell you what we did. I was just, I was just fooling anyway. We've got a new patented method now. We have a vacuum cleaner. We have a vacuum cleaner 14 feet high and 18 feet wide. And we put the vacuum cleaner out there, sucks in all the dirt from the whole treasure house. All right, go ahead, George. Turn on the vacuum cleaner. Right here, but I don't, I don't here you go. Oh, all right, now. Just hold your breath. Hold your breath. Here you go. Turn on the vacuum. Turn on the vacuum. Wait a minute, Philip. Philip, how many times did I have to tell you? Don't turn on the vacuum cleaner when you're standing in front of it. Now, please, turn it around, reverse. Make it come out that end. Go ahead now, turn it out. Oh, oh, it's a terrible mistake there. Oh, terrible. All right, well, let's get to work. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. Work, 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 work. All work and no play makes pack a dull boy, right? That's true, that's very true. All right, now, we got to... I got to show you something. Well, I... Uh, I got to show you something. George, why don't you yeah, clean up the treasure house? Now, wait a minute now. As I said, all work and no play makes that the You got to watch it. George is a dancer. Now, watch it. 
Yeah, you push this over here. Nice, All right, there you go. Come over here, George. Go ahead. What I had in mind really, Professor, was that we clean up the treasure house. If you don't mind, I'd like to clean up the treasure house a little bit. Why didn't you uh, say so before? Go ahead, George. Uh, all right, George. You got over here. Have some music. No, look. No, what I wanted to do is clean up the treasure house. You need George over and he's going to be dancing. <laughs> He's too tired. We got to help him rest. Help him rest. He's so tired. Two of us are... But you help him rest. Here we go. Rest. Everybody but, come down. But you don't have to help a man rest. He can rest so on either two of you clean up the He's thing. too tired. It takes three to rest here. Yeah. Professor uh, Irving is... Uh, uh, George is... Uh, oh, I don't know what I've gotten myself into. But we've got to get this treasure house cleaned up. I hope that they rest very fast. We'll see you here again in a minute and a half, and I hope by that time the George will be fully rested and Irving and the professor will have helped him rest. Oh, 
We will all be poor. Our poor families will be starving. Oh, no, because... The company will go on the rock. Oh, Professor, no. The will bam, slam no. right on the rock. No, Professor, no. We'll all wind up in the poorhouse. Not that, Professor, not and that. that's why... Irving's Irving got a juggle. Go. Yes, that's okay, right. that's fine. All right, let Irving juggle. Right, Irving, yeah. go ahead, Jeff. Come over here, everybody. Oh, you need music, too? Oh, 
taught you how to drive. Wow, Manfred, we're here. But what will we do now? A little higher, please. A little lower. A little to the left. Now, scratch. Manfred, have you ever heard of an itchy tree? Huh? Wowee, look! <laughs> Hello. Oh, focus, it, Manfred. It's a genie. Oh! Manfred, the genie is crying. You cried too, if you had to stand out here in the cold blue sky. But why don't you get back into your magic lamp? I can never get back in it till whoever I last gave three wishes to uses them all up. Look, you mean someone hasn't wished all his wishes? But who? I had it written down, but I lost it. I'm nothing but a sloppy beauty. There's only one person who can help me. He knows the answer to everything. Who's that? The flying sorcerer. And here he comes now. How do you do, Mr. Flying Sorcerer? I'm Tom Terrific, all-round full-time adventure lover. And this is my own true pink wonder dog, Mighty Manfred. What category is he in? And my question is, where can we find the genie's unused wish? May I think that over for a moment, Tom? You take all the time you like. <laughs> I'm afraid your time is up. Oh, of course. A whiff of this in a rolling dish. Drink the water, it's delicious. Follow the pail, follow the snow. If you make a mistake, go back to go. Uh, you're right. But what does that mean? That's for me to know and for you to find out. Oh, Manfred, the flying sorcerer answered us in a riddle. A whiff of this in a rolling dish. A whiff of this in a rolling dish. A whiff that's the answer, old brain man, Fred. I'll turn into a rolling dish, and it will lead us to the owner of the third wish. Thanks a lot, Mr. Flying Sorcerer. Should I come back next week? Uh, George and, and Irving woke up, but now they're having a little trouble. No, wait a minute. No, come on. Now. Yeah. He, he was trying to get up, but he has a little trouble getting up. <laughs> it's just, uh, it's George, Irving, why is that just to uh, uh, help Irving? Uh, that's just fine. That's just uh, Okay. We're all wound up with this. Now, 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 see, we can't. That's it. Uh, it's just to help him with that. Yeah. That's fine. Oh, 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 oh. You ready? Oh, okay, fine. Now, now. <coughs> we're all set to go, right? What's the matter? It's going to work. Don't you like juggling and dancing? I love juggling and dancing. Well, I think it's good wonderful, thing. but yeah. I want to get the treasure house cleaned up. That's good, because i got something else to show you. Oh, no. Now, uh, Irving is a juggler. Right, Irving George is a George is a dancer. Irving teaching George to juggle. Irving teaching George to juggle. Vice versa. Uh, George is teaching Irving, Irving to juggle. dance. Irving teaching George to juggle. That's what I thought you were saying. No, said. I want the boys to show you how they are coming along. Irving and George. 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 Irving and Wait a minute, wait a minute. Well, uh, you, need, you need, uh, you need to, you, hey, uh, all right, you hey, run a couple of... Oh, Mr. Goose has it. There we go. There we are. Here, yeah. we'll take it. You take it. No, you get it. Then, no, I'm not, I'm not anxious. Thank you. Now, leave right. This is tremendous. Make sure you see this. Now, George is learning. I taught these boys all they know. That's terrific. That's really wonderful. Except the mistake. Except the mistake. You can teach them. Now, George, you're going to teach Irving how to dance. Oh, that's wonderful. There, Irving. Go cool. ahead, Irving. That's a good one. Mm -hmm. It's one of my best ones, too. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, well, that's, that's really wonderful, fellas. I'm, I'm very glad that you've learned so much from each other. Now, till we get to work... Just a minute. Now, just, just a minute now. What do you think all this has been? Uh, rest. This is yes, the warm-up. Yes, no. Yes, uh, this is the warm-up for the really spectacular part of the Philharmonic Cleaning and Wrecking Company. I, myself, 
play this part. This is the grand climax to the whole shebang. Now, watch this. Step back, please. I got to have a little room. Got to have it very quiet so I can concentrate. Hold the breath. Hold the breath, please. Nobody make a sound. And I get in the mood here. All right, now then. Uh, Took me now 20 years. I had to train every hair by myself. Singly, one by one. One by yeah, one. All right, 15 now. months. I, yeah. You wanted the five dollars a hair. I'll train yours. No, you no, I don't want, no. I want to clean up. Come around the house. I give you. Okay, we'll all clean up. Here we go. Clean up. Clean up. All right, right. Come on. 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 No, no, you don't understand. It's a game all about uh, somebody named Cinderella. Oh, I remember. That's a story. That's right. And because That's a good idea. It's because we Where's think Cinderella? so much of a professor, because we think so Where much of you, there'd only be one person in this world who could be Cinderella. And that you mean is... an actor? Yes. You show excellent taste. You know I've been cutting the boards for 50 years. Yes. Well, that's oh, it. You're going to be Cinderella. So come that's on, great. professor. I want everybody to meet Cinderella. Oh, that's pretty good. Oh dear, Cinderella, Cinderella, all I feel is Cinderella from the moment that I get up. The shape is now you're falling, there isn't any let up. I hear them calling, calling, go up and do the ladder, and go down and do the cellar, and you can do them both together. I look good, I look good, I look good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come no, no, professor. No, professor. No, professor. No, no, you're supposed to duck. Tony, how do you do it? Duck. Kind of hurry, hurry. Over there. Tony, how do you do it over there? Tony, how do you do it over there? If I could live my fantasy. Cinderella, 
that's it. That's it, Professor. That's it. You, you do that. That's it. Yeah. 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 And you lose up. Here. Do some stuff. Yeah. 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 All right. All right. Play ball. Now the same thing. Yeah. Here you go. Come on.
You finished this part. I'm through. You drank the water, and it was the lift. But what are we supposed to find here? Fish, fish, millions of fish. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It would have taken me years to pick out these fish by myself. Who's that? I am Sinbad the Sailor, home from the sea. I collect fish. I love fish. Don't come any closer. I have plans for these fish. I'm going to build a castle entirely made of fish to remind me of my ocean voyages. <laughs> It'll be new, exciting, different. It'll make me so famous. I'll never have to use my third wish. <laughs> Sorry, man, but Sinbad is the man with the genie's third wish. But what's the good of finding Sinbad if he won't never ever use up his third wish? It's a riddle to me. Riddle? Of course, Manfred. You're hinting at the answer lies in the rest of the flying sorcerer's riddle. Let's see. It goes, follow the pale, follow the snow. If you make a mistake, go back to go. But what tale does the riddle mean? I pale at the sight of all that fish. Fish pale. That's it, Manfred. We're supposed to follow the fish tale. We followed Sinbad for hours. I wonder where he's going. I'm getting hungry. Hey, Sinbad, time out for a fishy break. Well, Tom will be back in just a minute to uh, finish the story for us. I've got everything they could possibly give the music out of the treasure house except this radio, and I'll take it out in just a second. Now, I'm going to ask the professor to come to the kitchen with me because he whistles, you know, and that wouldn't be good because he could whistle while they juggle and dance. And while I've got the professor out in the kitchen, then George and Irving can clean up the treasure house, right? Okay. Professor? Oh, professor? Yes, 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 uh, yes. How would you like to come to the kitchen with me for just a moment? Yes, please. You please. got something to eat there? Well, yeah. I That's think a good idea. That's fine. That's fine. I'll be right there, Professor. Right there. Where's the jam? Uh, you'll find it right in the cupboard. Where's the cake? Right above the refrigerator. Where's the cookies? Yeah, they're all there, Professor. Ice cream? Yeah, yes, everything. Watermelon? George! Hello! Irving! Wake up! Everybody left. Come on, let's try to get 
the mirror, I'm going to put my foot down. And boy, I mean just exactly that. Oh, look at them, right. <coughs> Look at that. Did you ever in all your life, not even the peacock in the garden honking can wake them up? Well, I'm going to do something about it. Believe me. <laughs> oh, boy, even though I don't feel like it. Hello there. How are you, Mr. Peacock? How do you know, how do I know that he's a Mr. Peacock? Uh, how come I don't know, uh, how, come, <coughs> how come I don't say hello, Miss Peacock? Well, because in the peacock uh, uh, species, the uh, the male, the boy, is the prettier one with the pretty tail and uh, the lovely plumage, feathers, right, Mr. <coughs> right, Mr. Moose? Yes, that's usually true of most animals, and even fishes. Is that right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're mostly lighter feathered or lighter colored, but the man. Mm-hmm. What's the, where does this fellow come from? Where does this fellow come from? Well, you know what his name is. What's his name? <laughs> Good name. What? Choo-choo. Choo-choo, huh? Yeah. He sounds like a choo-choo train. Oh, that's it. Honk like, <coughs> that's it. Honk like a choo-choo train. You know why? Why? Because <laughs> he's got a long train. Because he's got a long train. Oh, for goodness sake. He comes from Southeast Asia. You yeah, find him in <coughs> India. Okay. India and Taiwan uh-huh. and, and even Burma, uh-huh. which is you no know, north. Yeah. May, may I feed, feed him some uh, some yeah. bread? Yeah. Yeah. Here, you see, have some bread. Ah. You like it? Oh, have some. Come on. Right, you take I it? remember Mr. Greenwood saying about that peacock for you as um what song? Well, that's true. Like you sometimes. Ah. They, uh, they make a great noise when anybody comes in the farm here. I wish Mr. Green Jeans were not so busy on the farm today. He'd be able to help me out a little bit. Yeah. Oh, boy. But with him working away, I can't do much except try to get the professor and Irving and George to do a little work. Uh, uh, I think, Captain, you ought to just forget about it. Forget about it? Yeah. I got to get the treasure house cleaned up. It's I know, a but, terrible mess. But just get the whole thing out of your mind. Well, well, think about something uh, else. Yeah. What can I think about? Well, big happy thoughts. Well, oh, singing is always good. Singing? Yeah, you know, sing like a bird. Well, go on, Jackie. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Let's all sing like a bird. Let's all sing like... I can't sing. Well, try, Jackie. I mean, sing worthy. Let's all sing like a bird. I can't do it. All right, I'll give one last try. Let's all sing like the birdie sing. Sweet, 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 sweet. Let's all sing like the birdie sing. Sweet, 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 sweet. Let's all warble like night and day. Give your throat a scream. When some folks sing, they howl and yowl just like a pussy cat. Some folks sing flat, some sing like sawing wood. I'm one like that. But when the chicky birds sing in the trees, I feel we ought to try and sing like these. Rap, I'll sing like the birdie sing. Sweet, 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 sweet. Rap.
You're going to clean the treasure house. You don't know anything about cleaning. How no, do you know? No, I'm going to say an amateur. If you want to help, you amateur can. Amateur, you're going to clean the treasure house. You don't want to help, you don't have to. I'm going to have to clean the treasure house. All right. I'm going to get to work. Go to work. Go to work. Go to work. Well, 
Why, you've been watching the story. The Philharmonic Cleaning Service has done a beautiful job. Look, some magazines packed nicely. Says your house is all nice and dusted. The bed is all taken care of. Professor, I want to thank you very, very much. Thank you very much. Thank you, Irving. You're welcome. Thank you very much, George. A beautiful, beautiful job, and I want to thank you very much. All right, gentlemen, uh, I want to thank you for the work you did. Wait, and wait just a minute. You got to have inspection. Huh? How am I going to know if we did a good job and got everything clean if I don't inspect the place? Isn't that wonderful? Isn't now, that's that doing a thorough job. The place is all cleaned up, but he's got to inspect to make sure that the boys did a fine job. Why, right, that's fine. I really have. All right, that's right. the service again. Shun. A ten shun, I said there. Now, let me go inspect me. Let me see. That's pretty good, no dust. Oh, look at this. Boy, it's did a good job of the magazines. They're all lined up for the month. October, November, December, January, February, March, April, May. Yeah, I'm all right. That's very good. Yeah, just good. the way they should be. How about this pile? Yeah, oh, this is the one that's just done now. You coming on this end the 7th. And then the 14th, the 21st, the 28th. That goes right on down. A very good job. I would say that's an excellent job. Now, I'll look at the next. Inspector. Professor, the pillows are all fluffed up. Oh, that's good. Did you ever see a pillow fluffed up better than that? Beautiful, Professor. I want to see if they're doing the matches. Yeah, but Professor, yes, sir. You're not better You don't have to. There's no doubt. It's a story with you. What's the story of the hat? Professor, I'm going to look at the hat. Yeah, the pants are all fluffed up. But Professor, you just made the eyes off that they've done already. You're not inspecting the way it's all the dust out of the hat. Yeah, no, wait a minute, Professor. Oh, look at this shell. They got all the toys just on there.